Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a huge back to school try on clothing haul. That was a mouthful. <laughs> showing you guys everything I got for back to school shopping and I'm really excited because I got a lot of cute things and I've been dying to film this video and like I said this is going to be a try on clothing haul because we all know those are so much more interesting to watch and kudos to me for actually making this a try on clothing haul because this is a lot of stuff I'm not gonna lie you guys are about to see and if you're new to my channel and this is your first time seeing my face here on your screen, then click the subscribe button down below and also on the screen somewhere, I will have a link. You can click it and subscribe so you can stay for more and be updated every time I upload a video. That's exciting, yeah. So, without further ado, let's just go ahead and get started with this huge try on haul that is about to happen. Let's go. First store we're gonna start off with is Forever 21 because I got the most stuff from there. The first thing I got is just this plain black tank top. It just looks like this. And it's really, really cute. I like the cut on the back because it's kind of like a boxy shape, you know? It's black, it's cute, it's flowy. Everything a cute tank top should be. Yeah? Yeah. The next thing I got was just this dress and it is black and gray. It's super cute. The sleeves are just a charcoal gray color and then as well as the pocket in the corner and then the dress cinches and it's just black. It looks really short. It kind of is short on me but it's not like super, super short where people look at me and like, what the heck is she thinking wearing that? Like it looks like a shirt. No, you can definitely wear this and then not try to like look like you're dressing up, you know? It's like one of those casual things. Next I got this shirt, which is a little bit more dressy and I have not worn this one yet, hence the tag is still on it. It's like a tan, orangey color, I don't know, but it's really, really cute and the material is super thin and lightweight, so you're not gonna get hot in this. Kinda um, more girly if I wanna feel like dressing up and you know looking like my gender for the day okay, then I got another dressy shirt and this one I've already worn it looks like this and it's super super colorful I love the colors on this because it has purple and pink and like this tannish brown color and I just think this, this looks really cute and professional and then the back it has a zipper at the top which actually unzips which I didn't know that but it actually comes like undone I feel like this looks like something my mom would wear to work I don't know why, it just looks really professional, like an office working type of shirt. You feel? No? Okay. All right, back to the basic stuff, enough girly things. I got a plain basic tee from Forever 21, and it's just this really nice cream color. Um, I don't know, I like this color a lot. I thought it looked good on me. And it just it's a basic tee, you know, with the pockets, the sleeves are a little bit of um, like rolled up. I think it's good to have like basic tees in your closet for days when you don't feel like trying to look good at school, also known as like every day. Moving on, I have a romper from Forever 21, which I'm absolutely in love with. This romper is so freaking adorable. It's like this burnt orange color and it is so cute. And it has like, um, like a flowy overlay kind of thing at the top here and it cinches. I wore it to school, I got a lot of compliments, I was very happy, it's cute and yeah. Then I just got a pair of plain black leggings. You know, Forever 21 leggings are like the bomb. Um, fall slash winter is like gonna be coming soon, so that's like the season where you wear sweaters with leggings and boots, and that's just the trend. So I decided to get a pair now because why not? Then I have these um, high-waisted ripped button-up shorts from Forever 21, and these are kinda cheeky, kinda not, but I can definitely not wear these to school. Just let you know, these are not for school. But there's always a next year for summer, so that will be the season for these. They're just ripped and high-waisted, and they don't have a zipper, because all they do, like, they're literally just buttons. They don't have a zipper or anything. Um, and then the pockets are, like, plaid, and, like, you can see the plaid through the rips. They're super cute, and I love them. And I can't wear them now, like I said, because it's going to be getting cold soon, and I can't wear these to school, but there's always a next year. Summer 2K16. I almost forgot about this thing. I got a black leather jacket, which is definitely not like me, but I tried this one on and it was so cute and I just loved the fit. And yeah, it just looks like this. It's a black, like bicycle, motorcycle looking jacket, you know? And it's leather, fake leather, I'm pretty sure. And it was only $21, like, 
you, we had to get it, okay? Yeah. And the last thing I got from Forever 21 were a pair of shoes. They are just like these tan sandals and they have like these jewels on them. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. And they have like a little heel thing. And oh, I haven't worn these yet because they still have the tag on them because I'm just waiting. I was trying to figure out what to wear them with because these are definitely not a pair of shoes that you can just wear every day with anything. You have to style these. So that was everything I got from Forever 21. And now moving on to American Eagle, which is where I got all of my jeans for back to school. The first pair of jeans that I got um, are actually my favorite. And I wish I could wear these every freaking day, but I obviously can't because that's kind of gross. They look like this. They're just the dark wash or like a medium wash, I guess you can say, jean. And they have rips on them and they're super cute. And if you guys want to know the exact style, these are these super, super stretch jeans from um, American Eagle. I think they're under like the jeggings section. Then the next pair I got were just super, super dark wash. I wanted a pair of super dark wash jeans because I've never owned a pair this dark before. Um, but yeah, I wore these like in my outfit of the week video as well if you want to see what they look like. And the last pair of jeans that I got are just black jeans again the super super stretch jegging and skinny cute awesome i just think it's good to have a pair of plain black jeans in your wardrobe so i got that cool beans beans are cool and then the last two things i got from american eagle are shirts the first one is just this plain black or black and white shirt and it says venice los angeles california where i want to live yeah this is one of their soft and sexy t-shirts and i really like it it's really nice material and comfortable i have not worn this shirt yet next shirt i got is also from the soft and sexy t-shirts line from american eagle it looks like this and it's super cute and it has like stripes with like maroon and blue and white and like a tealish baby blue color and it's really comfortable and soft and i got this in a size extra large when i saw it my mom was already like checking out and i just like picked it up when i saw it and i was like i want this too so i didn't even like look at the size i just kind of like saw the pattern and the style and i was like that's cute hurry up and get it in there moving on to the next door i went to pack sun and got two shirts um, I didn't get a lot from there because one of two reasons one there was a whole bunch of people when I went in And I was I hate shopping when there's so many people around me because it's just overwhelming and I hate it So I try to get in and get out and two Pakistan is freaking expensive like holy crap like it is super expensive everything in there and I'm happy I just found two shirts for the prices that they were the first shirt I got is just this like maroon color it looks red actually no it looks pretty true to color i don't know it looks darker in person than it is on camera it is just a maroon shirt with like this circle tribal design um i don't know what you would call that but it's just a circle design in the center and it's super basic and i like this a lot it's kind of fitting and it's really really soft and stretchy so i definitely like that about it and then the next shirt i got is a plain black shirt which i absolutely love i recently just wore this last week to school and i got so many compliments on it and people were like oh my god i love your shirt and i was like is it just me or does anyone else love it when people compliment you on your outfits like it makes me feel so good about myself and it makes me feel like i have my life together when really i don't so this is just a plain black shirt that i got and what i love about it is the mesh or um net detailing it just has it on the sleeve and also like right across the stomach and when i wore it to school i had to wear a tank top underneath there or else i would have gotten dress coded for you seeing my belly button it's just a plain black shirt but with a twist and i love shirts that do that because they look so simple but yet they're so unique you know i went to sears and i've never shopped at sears really for clothes but we were walking through and i saw some cute things and i decided to take a look and i found some things that i like so I'm going to show them to you. First thing I got is actually the shirt I wore on the first day of school. It is just this army green flowy baby doll type style shirt. Um, it also has a stain of queso on it because I got queso on it. It has like a tank top cut to it and it's super flowy and I love it. And the material like changes towards the end. Like it changes into this like sheer wrinkly material. I don't know how to describe it, but it just changes at the end and it's super cute and flowy. And I like this a lot. Then I have a kimono 
that I got because I only have one kimono and it's the one that I wore a whole bunch last year. That floral one, you guys have seen it before. Um, so I decided to get another one so I don't have to wear that one again. And it looks like this. It's super crazy. Like the pattern on it is like flowers and then it has like these like paisley things on it. I don't know. It's super crazy and colorful. I just like the colors of it mainly. That's why I got it. And it also has the fringes at the bottom. And the last thing I got from Sears is a sweater. It is just this plain black sweater with like a white um, band lining thing up here. And then it's long sleeve because it's a sweater. And then on the sleeve it has that net like see-through detailing that I like. I don't know why but I love shirts with this detail. Like I think it's so cute. And yeah i love it a lot and i can't wait to wear it for the fall season it looks so sporty as well like you can wear this with probably like nikes or something like then i went to charlotte russe and i didn't find anything but this sweater oh look what a surprise it's black and white so i got this long sleeve shirt or it's not really a long sleeve it's kind of like a quarter sleeve like it stops okay it stops like like right here like a quarter sleeve kind of thing um but it's black and white and it's striped and i love the cut of this it also has like these two pockets it's really flowy and i really really like it um i can't wait to wear it once it gets cold out i think it'll look cute next door i went to was rue 21 and the first thing i got is this long sleeve and it looks like this it is like black at the top and then like this maroon color on the bottom and in the corner it says killing it and then along the back, it also says killing it, if you can see that. Um, it's very, very, very thin material. Like, you are not going to get super hot in this. Like, look, you can literally see my face through this. It's so sheer. Then I got two shirts that are, like, the same style, but two different colors slash patterns. The first one is just black and white, and then it has, like, these pink stripes on the sleeve. And then the next one I have is, like, the same exact style, except it's cheetah at the top with black stripes, and it's white. And I've actually worn this one already as well. Then I got three of their graphic tees because they had some really cute ones. And I'm not a big graphic tee person, but I saw these and I was just like, I can't resist. So the first one I got is white and it's like this hot coral pink color up here. And it says local celeb. And I just thought this was funny. I'm not a local celeb, so that's why I'm going to wear this and think I'm cool. One. really I'm not next one I got is, is this one and it's gray with like black lining and it says messy hair don't care and this is seriously me in a shirt because I don't ever do my hair and 99% of the time my hair is messy and guess what I don't care Brie actually has this shirt so we're gonna twin one day not to school though because We've tried that before and it was a fail once we realized someone else who was not meant to twin with us wore the same shirt and it looked like all three of us had planned it the last one that I have is black with white lining and it says take me to Neverland and it has like Peter Pan and Tinkerbell and then the three other people that I don't know their names of from the Peter Pan yeah it's cute I liked it and it's also black and white moving on to a store called garage which I've never shopped at before but I was walking by and I looked into like the window and I was like, oh my gosh, looks so cute. So I went in and I looked at some of their stuff. I did find this jean jacket and I have always wanted a nice quality jean jacket. And I think I might have just found one. It's super cute and it fits me so well. Like, I don't think you understand. Like, this is going to be my new fall favorite. Like, I'm going to be wearing this a lot. And yeah, if you guys are looking for like a good quality jean jacket and you don't want to spend a whole bunch of money, go to Garage. I think this was like $50, but it's so, like it's good quality, so it's worth it. We are dying down on the clothes now. I have two more things to show you and they are both from Ross. The first one is a sweater. It looks like this. It is just white with gray sleeves and it actually has like a little hoodie and it says California on the pocket with like the bear and it's super cute and it's gray down there. And once again, this is like more of a fall kind of clothing piece. Um, and then the last clothing piece I got from Ross was this cardigan, which is definitely out of like my usual, I guess you could say. It's a super, super long cardigan. It goes like right behind my knees and it's like this tie dye. I don't even know what pattern you would call this, but it looks like that. And it's short sleeve. I don't know. Something about it just like interested me. 
and I almost put it back but I was like no like I have to get it and I'm gonna figure out a way to wear this I don't know what or how I would style it but it's definitely something that's gonna challenge me and I'm always up for a good challenge so also from forever 21 I forgot to show you guys this but I got a necklace and it's just a gold necklace it looks like this you want to focus hey um, and it's like a little triangle and then it has like a little block thingy dangling and it was cute I got this to go with my outfit for the first day of school because the military green shirt I felt like needed an accessory and an accessory so I got that and now finally the last things I have to show you are just shoes so let's get through them and finish this haul first two pairs of shoes that I got are from Payless and these are what the first pair look like they are like a Jesus sandal inspired shoe um, you know wanna be Birkenstocks but they look like this and they're black and they're super comfortable and then I also got these sandals which I have been wearing a ton these are the only sandals I wear to school because they're so cute but they're just black and they are completely blinged out all of these little sequins so cute I love them and and the last pair of shoes that I got for the back to school season is Converse! Ah! So I don't know if you guys remember, but I think it was in my May favorites. I mentioned my Converse, my black ones being a favorite, and how I said I was going to come back and get the white ones for back to school shopping. And I told you. They are just the plain white Converse with the red and blue stripes like lining. And they're so comfortable. I've only worn them once because I'm so scared to get them dirty. But I wore them um, the first week of school. So you guys can go check out my outfits of the week for the first week of school video. And that is it. That is everything for my back to school clothing haul. That was a long one. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, give it a thumbs up as well as subscribe. And don't forget to follow me on like my social media. All of it will be linked down below. And if you guys did not know, I have a second channel, which is my vlog channel, where I am now going to be starting weekly vlogs. And I'll be uploading a vlog every Monday. So you guys should definitely go over to that channel and subscribe because I'm going to be getting back into it pretty soon. I think that's everything I have to say for this outro. Hope you guys enjoyed and have a wonderful day. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.